Hello folks, we have our workshop on um, this weekend, September 13th and 14th. We have a, a detailed workshop on algebra. We're going to cover all things algebra. Fine. So we're going to cover some ground, but I want to outline how we are going to do this. Fine. So we're going to have theory classes that help us uh, wire our brains towards uh, algebra. And very important. I think the mothership in algebra is quadratic equations. More than half the questions come from there. Even for more complicated exams, the starting point is very much quadratic equations. And so in quadratic equations, we will start from scratch, not just for solving, not just minus, plus, minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac by 2a. I hate that formula. And so we are going to talk about um, visual representative, we are going to talk about graph, we are talking about function, we are going to talk about peaks, maximum, minimum, we are going to talk about how cutting the x-axis, cutting the y-axis, what does it mean, all of that. Very, very important to learn from fundamentals, from, from scratch. I am going to think about um, x and y in the context of quadratic equations. I am going to draw this, 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 this and what does each of these mean in the context of thinking about it as ax square plus bx plus c. And very important, very, very, very fundamental but very crucial to learn it. And second thing we are going to do is if you think about any time you are doing algebra, we are going to talk about half of it as quadratic equations. Right? We are going to talk about inequalities, functions, polynomials. We will add a little bit of linear equations into this. Inequalities, functions are algebraic topics. Quadratic equations is the bedrock. And so linear and quadratic equations the bedrock. And so we start dealing with x's and y's from linear equations and then graduate to quadratic equations and then kind of learn, learn about that. And so what we will do is we will learn this from scratch. So we have a very thorough understanding of it. Extend that understanding into inequalities and functions and extrapolate a little bit to cover polynomials. Not just that, we will add a layer around this so, where we will include topics like percentages, mixtures, pipes and cisterns, number theory, geometry, every one of these topics comes kind of allied with x's and y's. You can have geometry questions that rely on algebraic ideas. You can have pipes and systems questions that talk about an open-ended number of pipes of number of hours for each pipe. What we are going to do, we are going to cover the ground on this theoretically and cover a bunch of questions from all of this that rely on algebraic uh, premises. So we are going to do funda building here, extrapolating that funda building here and solving algebra framework, al using algebra as a toolkit to solve anything and everything across all these topics. Right? So, so the, the mothership is here, of course, no doubt about it, absolutely. Right? But this part is super important as well. And sometimes I think when people think about algebra, they think about linear equation, quadratic equation, learn four formulae and inequalities and functions and be done with it. And so we want to climb on top of this and spend a lot of time there and then do this and then extrapolate that over here. So that, that, that's the plan. Uh, from first principles, the bunch of tests all linked to getting geared for CAP. And so the, the exam is the deal. So a lot of our learning has been to set the blocks in place to attack CAT-like questions and do a ton of cat-like questions and get practice for that. And sometimes I think merely practice won't do. The thought process is not there. Each question is just one question, not the framework for attacking similar questions. So we're going to provide the framework and do a bunch of questions. I'm, I'm rather looking forward to it. I've done a, uh, uh, we've created a bunch of questions for it. Uh, uh, we've probably gone overboard in the, the, the level of difficulty and quantity and quality of uh, questions. Uh, I want, I'm, I'm, I'm going all out, I should have fun uh, over this weekend. So if you're thinking about, hey, look, I need to get a handle on algebra, you must sign up and then have a hack at this, right? Best wishes for you.